With temperatures nearing the century mark, fire experts are asking the community to stay alert with outdoor burning activities. Local fire departments are seeing an increase in grass fires. Brian saw one of those today. Zach Summers is live outside of Brian Fire Station. And Zach, how did that fire start? Luke, firefighters say that grass fire started after what a 911 caller described as sparks coming from the wheel of a trailer. Now, it burned about six acres out on Highway 47 and Leonard Road. It took firefighters about 45 minutes to put it out. And really, it just goes to show how dry conditions are becoming. Fire experts say the rain we saw in May and June has led to more grass in the area, which means fire can carry over to larger areas when conditions start to dry out. Now that we have more grass, we have more fuel to burn. So it kind of causes concern for us because now we know that there could, there's a potential for more fires to burn hotter and to burn longer and are harder to control for the firefighters who respond to those fires. Now, the Texas A&M Forest Service says grass fires are the most common fires during this time of year, followed by timber and brush fires. Debris burning is the number one cause of wildland fires in Texas. They say the fire season outlook doesn't look too bad, but as always, we should stay cautious when grilling or, you know, at campfires or things like that. We're live in Bryan tonight. Zach Summers, KX HD News.